so the becoming of Clarity Creative was that doing web dev, creating websites was a hobby. It was something fun, something I loved to do, you know, and, and, and like to do it on my own. But I realized that there was a very quick ceiling that I would hit. Clients would ask for content. There's conversation pieces you have to have with them. There's communication that you have to do. There's uh, engagement. And then when you're staring at a website for a day or two, you kind of get lost in it and get blinded by it. So I realized I couldn't do it alone and really wanted to kind of team up with somebody. Uh, obviously, uh, Craig kind of came, came, you know, on board in terms of being somebody with that expertise. David and I know each other for like 27 years at this point. We've been friends since middle school. We went to high school together, we went to college together. Our mothers have the same first name. I just, that's, we know each other that way where it's like a brother relationship at this point. And in 2008, he came to me and he said, hey man, would you join me on this journey that I'm on? I knew he was doing it already for people. I, we had even talked about some of those projects. And what he asked of me was to talk to people and to write, which those were like literally two of the things that I could do in life. From there, the, the, the business kind of grew and took on our first project and, and went from there. I still viscerally remember that high five that David and I had in the car leaving Rudy's Auto Body Shop. That was again our first kind of paid client that paid us for a site. And through that journey, we kept it as a side hustle. It was this thing we did nights and weekends for years, but kept adding clients. People kept telling somebody else. It was all word of mouth. Yes, we had a website up, but we always, funnily enough, forgot to market ourselves on the website. It was just referral after referral after referral. Come 2016, we've been doing it for eight years at his house, at my house, at coffee shops, at clients' places. We looked at each other and it was like, this might need to go to another level. We wanted to get a small office and David committed to leaving his full-time, very secure, very, very well-paid job to go all in on this. That was the critical inflection point, 2016. We moved into our Winter Springs office, we began hiring staff, and things kind of took off from there. The growth of the company has just been phenomenal. It's been exciting. It's been, um, I, I blink and I can't believe just how many, uh, how many clients we have, you know, how many team members there is and just how it all works together, right? In a, a really like really um, just organized flow, you know, where we're able to take ideas from, from you know, a, a client meeting to then, you know, just a few months later, it's, you know, a live website with people filling out forms and data being tracked and stuff ranking. It's like, wow, we did that. And, and, and usually there's a little part that everybody's kind of had a, a piece in and it's, you know, it's, it's their efforts, their energies, their kind of input that really gets us to a great finished project. We started out as a task focus agency and really it, it served a purpose, but what would end up happening is we'd hit a very fast ceiling and, um, the goal focus, usually we know what we're going for. Is it leads? Is it phone calls? Is there something that they're looking to get out of it? So it becomes less of, can you put up a web page for me or a website for me or a piece of content for me? And what are you trying to get out of that? And once that, that kind of goal is kind of put forward, then the action to help that page rank or to add necessary CTAs or other things to really kind of hit the client's goal is what we're usually trying to go after. And that led to hiring new people, adding more to the team, and what we are today, which is an organization of 11 people with full-time content development, full-time uh, website development, video support, social media support. It kind of became this thing all out of an original friendship of two kids that had some like-mindedness and mothers with the same